The Better Business Bureau of Central Kentucky, as well as local law enforcement agencies, have recently put out releases regarding some phone scams. However, WBON TV Studios had a viewer come up and played one for us that seems to be a little bit more threatening than the others. Hey, did you know Wallingford Media Group develops, designs, and manages websites? Well, we do. Contact us soon for your brand new website, but let us give you a fresh new makeover. And once it gets expired after that, you will be taken under custody by the local police, as there are four serious allegations pressed on your name at this moment. We would request you to get back to us so that we can discuss about this case before taking any legal action against you. The voicemail then directs to be called back for more information, so we did just that with the listener. Um, yeah, my name's Dave. You just called me. I live in Kentucky, and uh, you say you got four warrants out on me? Uh, I don't know anything about that. Yeah, you say you got some warrants on me. You called me and said to call this number, you have some warrants. What are the warrants about? What's your name? Yeah, my name, my name is Dave. And you called me in Richmond, Kentucky just about 15 minutes ago. I'm sorry? Well, I'm sorry too. What are the warrants about? Deputy Michael Stotts of the Madison County Sheriff's Office said to never answer the phone if you ever receive a call or a voicemail like this, and if you do feel so inclined, you can contact local law enforcement or even the Attorney General's office with the complaint. For more stories such as these, be sure to visit Richmond's very own WBONTV.com. I'm Marissa Hempel.